we lived in Berkeley. If you lived through the 60s, you kind of know what I'm talking about. There was a lot of resistance toward the way things had been done in the past, including farming with chemicals, and DDT was already being fingered for causing problems with the wildlife and health problems. We were reading Organic Gardening Magazine, which just came out. I think I actually started reading that in probably the late 50s and early 60s, but it was a lot of small, you know, like backyard things that were seemed con conceivable and, and uh, it was not being translated to larger acreages early on. It was more small stuff, doing a little plot of ground, you know. There was still a fear once we got here that, you know, we had to earn a living at this and it's not easy starting from the ground up. So we started out doing things conventionally and just thinking about doing it organic. As our son was born, you know, you start put two and two together that if you just sprayed some insecticide in the orchard and now the little guy's running out there in his bare feet, that is probably not a good idea. So I kind of kind of uh, sealed the deal that we had to change our approach and do something that we felt better about and we knew that would be good for him and good for the planet, you know, and good for every everybody. So we slowly uh, talked to other farmers that were of the same, of the like mind, and Yolo County happens to have a lot of organic farmers. We're one of the biggest centers for organic farming, probably in the country, certainly in California. And there are neighbors and friends of mine that have been doing this as long as we have, and, and they all, they were transitioning too. Some of them went to school in Davis and, and learned about, you know, being able to sustain the soil and not whip it with uh, chemicals and just build it up and it'll give it back to you again eventually and that's sort of the approach that we've tried to take. Cover cropping, compost, uh, food for the plants that uh, you know make sense and it's not a no need to be fearful of.